Right now. What's going on y'all, it's your boy AB and we are back with another video. Today we are going to be doing a jewelry and fragrance haul from DHgate. I'm really excited to do this haul actually um, because I have been interested in getting some jewelry from DHgate. I feel like I got some pretty nice things. I do have one item still on the way but I am going to insert a clip of me unboxing that item into this video. I have already unboxed and worn these items. I didn't unbox the fragrance yet because I wanted to unbox with you guys but the items that I did unbox was the earrings and necklace from Vivian Westwood they did come in a box like this I didn't actually wear the Vivian Westwood out yet but I did unbox it to see what it was hit for you feel me so um, this is what the necklace looked like let's open the necklace first um, it came passive wrapped in a box like this it does have the um, bag inside the box also it didn't come with any other papers I don't believe um, unless they're under the bag. Nothing's under the bag, so let's go ahead and unbox this uh, necklace really fast. Comes in a nice... Oh, this is the Cartier! Okay, well, sh scratch that. This is the Cartier ring. <laughs> yes, I got a Cartier ring. Um, I was really excited to get this Cartier ring because I don't have any rings. So it does come in a nice Cartier, a nice Cartier dust bag here. Nothing on the back, but it is very nice. Nice velvety material for the dust bag. Very nice quality. Um, the squeeze thing here works really well. The squeeze thing. <laughs> the pull tabs, like I don't know, what do you call these? Work really well right there. Um, pull out the ring here and it comes um, in a bag like this. This is a size eight. And I was kind of uh, scared about sizing the ring because I don't have rings and I've never really wore ring, ring, blah, blah, ring, ring, red ring. I never, I've never worn, <laughs> I never wore rings before. So um, this is actually my first ring and I'm really excited for it. I've already wore it um, out and I think it's a hit. I really like it. Um, I did get a size eight because uh, I am a size eight because the ring fits. I would wear it on this finger here. It fits really well. It's a really nice ring here, but hopefully you can see here. I got the diamonds on there, but yeah, this is how look. This is how the ring looks on on the hand, and yeah, I really like this ring actually. It fits really well. Like I said, they do go up to a size ten. If you are interested in a size ten ring, or if you got big fingers. Cause I know people, some people I feel like have been looking for a size 10 rings um, on DHgate and I found one. Cartier right here is really nice. This is a really nice ring. Um, really nice color gold. Um, I have some other gold jewelry and I compared it to the, my other gold jewelry. I don't know. I was trying to fix the lighting situation. Um, I did try to kind of change something up. So hopefully the lighting looks a little different or and or better you feel me but on the inside here it does say Cartier 750 uh, 56 I don't know what that means it has the holes for the little diamonds this is supposed to have be Swarovski crystals in real life I'm not sure if this is Swarovski, uh, Swarovski crystals in DH gate life but that's what this is supposed to be um let's move on to the next one i remember now that i put um both of my vvs vvm westwoods <laughs> i was about to say vvs's <laughs> i put both of my vv uh, i still was about to say vvs <laughs> um, vvm westwood i got some earrings and a bracelet um it came in a packaging like this bubble wrap just like this um bow tie on it and everything like this i don't know if i like this lighting okay hopefully the lighting is a little bit better now because i feel like it was just too bright on the boxes on the box so this is a vvm westwood box um came wrapped like this um with the bow around it i wrapped the bow open up the box um it came in bags like this um little vvm westwood bags right there um like i said i do have earrings and a necklace they both came in little dust bags like this really nice really they're really nice in a way but then again they're very cheap, very cheap uh, quality dust bags. Um, these drawstrings, they do work, but they're not the be like they're not the best drawstrings. Um, let's go ahead and open up this one first. So these are the earrings, and the thing about the earrings is, I definitely wanted them to be small. Well, I was hoping they were going to be smaller, 
but they are actually pretty big um, I did try them on they do actually look kind of dope even though they're kind of big but here is the Vivian Westwood I'm trying to get low it's not going to pick it up But just there we go, there we go. Pick up that VVs. Okay, so these are the Vivian Westwood earrings. I feel like they look really nice. I feel like the um, crystals in it looks really good. It does have a nice little shine to it. Put them in for y'all. So the clasps in the back of the earring, it is has a Vivian Lil Westwood right there on the back of the little ear clasps. I think that's dope, I love that. This one has um, this little Vivian Westwood uh, tag on it as well. I don't know what that is, but y'all can scan that and let me know down in the comments what that is right there. This one also has the VVs on the back of the thing here are the Vivian Westwoods here's what they look like on your ear so the Vivian Westwood earrings do have a nice uh, weight to them I feel like they are pretty heavy on your ears even though they are pretty big I still feel like they just have a nice uh, weight to them as far as you know you want your jewelry to feel good you want your jewelry to have a nice you know to say the least it feels good as a piece of jewelry our next piece we're going to open up is the vivian westwood necklace i've always wanted some vivian westwood jewelry i'm really excited that um they i found a seller on dh gate that sells um some vivian westwood jewelry this pearl necklace here i honestly think that the pearls in the necklace are not very good quality the necklace does kind of have like a cheap feel to it very much so you bought it at some side jewelry store. i don't know like some kid jewelry store like claire's or something it does have some nice features on it though as far as on the clasp here it does have uh, vivian westwood on the clasp if you can see i don't know if you can see it but it says it has the vivian westwood symbol right here on the clasp on both sides and also has says Vivian Westwood right here on this little dangly thing here. It says Vivian Westwood. And on the other side, it has the um, Vivian Westwood symbol on the other side. Now this piece feels really decent. It feels more of a decent piece of jewelry. Like the, the pearls feel really cheap. Um, but this piece right here feels really good. It actually looks good. It has a nice little sparkle to it. Here it is, Vivian Westwood Pearl Necklace. Let me go ahead and try it on for y'all real quick. All right, so this is what the necklace is hitting for. I actually did buy this necklace for myself, so I'll probably be, you know, dressing real nice if I'm wearing this. These, these pearls ain't coming out just for any old occasion, you feel me? <laughs> But the earrings, I actually could wear the earrings, you feel me? Honestly, probably not. I probably won't wear any of this without wearing any of it together. Like, I, I have to wear the earrings and the brace, uh, and the necklace. Um, I did want to get a bracelet, but I totally forgot that I actually wanted to get a bracelet. So the bracelet didn't make it into the cart. All the Cartier stuff made it into the cart. Kind of what they looked at. Ooh, you'll see them earrings. Y'all see them earrings sparkling? All right, so let's move on to our next piece of jewelry, Cartier. Once again, but here it is. It's a uh, Cartier box um, it came in a shipping box like this it did come with the bag also and it also has some Cartier uh, card right there and it has uh, these Cartier papers here as well or this right here that's that's a paper go ahead and open the box let's go ahead and so I already wore it but it is a Cartier bracelet it comes in a box like this I did have to buy the box so the Vivian Westwood box and the Cartier box that you see here I had to purchase because for some reason they don't sell the jewelry with the box if you don't get the jewelry with a box you'll get them in a bag like this <laughs> so um, I didn't order the ring with a box because I feel like I can put the ring in another jewelry box that I use I did want the bracelet for a box because I wouldn't have a way to store the bracelet with out me feeling comfortable about it I guess so I went ahead and opted to get the box which was a pretty penny make sure you guys probably have a place to store your jewelry um, so you don't have to buy the box but it came wrapped around this little thing like this with the tool to open and close it putting this on you do need a screwdriver tool here um, they do give you one in the box this is not an easy thing to do by yourself so i'm gonna go ahead and put it on for you guys really fast i did opt to get the um cartier bracelet with the sororski crystals in it so ooh, look at that shine right there that's how you see it right there um, but yeah so it does come with uh little crystals in there 
with the Cartier or whatever, um, like whatever logo circle right there. I don't know what that is, but it has little diamond Kurosky crystals in there. It does say Cartier inside of the bracelet as well. The other side doesn't have anything on it. Here's what it looks like on. I feel like this is a pretty nice piece of jewelry. I mean, it's pretty hefty as well. It has some nice weight to it. it. Has nice shine to it. The diamonds or the crystals in it has nice shine as well. The jewelry tool. I mean, everything looks really nice. Like, let me. It's a pretty solid piece of jewelry, is what I'm trying to say there. All right, so I got the earrings. Don't worry about the background or anything like that. The earrings did come in a bag like this, a small pouch. This was the only thing that came shit with the earrings because I opted not to get the box. I did order two sets of earrings. So I got a set here, which says stainless steel. Sorry about the lighting as well. So here is another pair here. I did get the ones that are gold with the diamonds in them. The real ones come with Swarovski crystals. I'm sure these aren't Swarovski crystals. So I did end up getting two pair, one a little bigger than the other because I do have a cartilage piercing at the top. So I'm going to use the smaller one in the cartilage and then the bigger ones on the main ears. These are the Cartier earrings. To open them, you just pull them apart like that and they open up so you can put it in. And then you clamp it back close. Like if I can clamp it back close. So you gotta like push it down a little bit to get it closed, but you just pull them open like that. And then you like kind of clamp it down in there like that. So this is one of our bigger pieces, our bigger ones, our bigger earrings, Cartier earrings with the diamond in it and then let me pull up one of the smaller ones for you guys as well i only have one cartilage piercing so the smaller one is i'm gonna try to put it around my car my up here but um we'll see because it's kind of small like i'm already looking at it like this is this is super small so and i'm gonna put them both up here as comparison size comparison so i ordered one size smaller for my cartilage and then you know the size bigger size for my earrings let me go ahead and put them in for you so i got it in but it's hard to clamp it close it's so hard let me see if i can get the other one because i can't get that one for some reason this one went on pretty easy. The other one is kind of hard. Okay, dangly earrings. I've had dangly earrings since I was a kid, y'all. Okay, this one is kind of hard to put on. I gotta, I gotta figure out how to clamp this one. But this one is in, and like I said, I had no hoop earrings since I was a kid, and this is, it's pretty heavy. Like it's got some nice weight to it, which is nice. Let me go ahead and try to put this cartilage in real quick. Like where is it at? I feel like I had it. Okay, I need a mirror. <clears throat> All right, so I got the eyes, right, y'all. So I got the earrings in, hoop earrings, Cartier hoops. Let me get the focus. Cartier hoop earrings. This is what they're looking like. Um, sorry about the lighting. I know the lighting is pretty bad. Try to get as close as I can. Cartier earrings with the diamonds in it, and this is what the other ear looks like with the cartilage piercing. <sighs> Let me see. Trying to get close for y'all. So this is what the cartilage looks like with the dangly earring. So the cartilage, this part, this one up here is really small. Actually, it's too small. Let me see if I get to focus on. Like I would need to. Why can I see this? Because the you know why you know why I can't see it. But anyway, these are the earrings. I do like the earrings. Like I said, the cartilage is a little bit too small up here. And this earring, I do have to like push the 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 latch down to go into the to keep it latched. I mean that's kind of annoying. But actually, all in all, I do like these earrings. I'm gonna give these earrings a five out of five. Um, I would definitely suggest them. They definitely are. Uh, definitely, they definitely look good. Like these these look good. Good. You feel me? Oh, let me go ahead and give a rating to everything so far. <laughs> Cartier ring. I feel like the Cartier ring is definitely a five star. Um, 10 out of 10 would recommend y'all go out there and get y'all one of these Cartier rings. These Cartier rings is really nice. Um, like I said, I wear a size eight, so make sure you do know your ring size before you purchase the Cartier ring. Vivian Westwood earrings, five star. 
10 out of 10 would recommend. I feel like, like I said, this is a pretty hefty piece of jewelry. Shine on it on the crystals are pretty nice, nicely simulated or whatever. Uh, make sure you guys go out there and get you some of these earrings because let me tell you something, these VVs, <laughs> these VVs. Vivian Westwood necklace, pearl necklace. I'm definitely gonna give it, zooming on that necklace a little bit. I'm definitely feeling like I'm gonna give it a four out of five. Um, I wasn't really feeling how these pearls feel. They just don't feel, I mean, I know they're not real pearls, but they just feel so cheap. Like they just feel so cheap. Granted, I didn't pay that much money for the necklace. I still just feel like these pearls feel so cheap. I don't know what I expect the pearls to feel like. I don't know what I expect. I never had a pearl necklace. So maybe I'm just tripping. I could be overreacting. But I'm still going to give it a 4 out of 5. I do like uh, the accents and the piece, uh, the jewelry piece itself on the necklace. So... And the Cartier bracelet. Cartier bracelet, man. Y'all go ahead and get y'all one of these Cartier bracelets. This is definitely a 10 out of 10 would recommend five star status this is five star status right here that's all of the jewelry that we have for this video i am going to go ahead to our fragrance section which is only one fragrance and i'm super excited to open it up it's a super popular fragrance it did come in a packaging like this it does feel like it has some styrofoam over the actual box that i'm assuming that it's in for the fragrance so let me go ahead and open up this box um i do like to open up and rate the packaging as well i feel like the packaging is so far five star packaging five star packaging got the foam tightly wrapped around um taped up let me grab my sizzles boom baccarat come on man get into that box this right here and how it's wrapped up in this plastic is making me think this is the real Baccarat. Like why, like look at this packaging, look at this box. Like is this a real box of Baccarat or what? Is this a real box? Scan this QR code right here and tell me what it say. Drop a comment down below, cause I'm not scanning it. They got the KK, up the, oh, let me go ahead and open it up. This plastic, is this the real plastic that comes on the Baccarat box? Is this the real, this shit is already smelling good. This is already smelling good. Is this the real Baccarat box? Somebody drop a comment down below and tell me if this is the real Baccarat box. This is looking pretty legit. This is looking pretty legit. Got the KK on the top, you feel me? Says Vapor What does it say? Vapor is a tour. Vapor is a tour. Natural spray. This is a natural spray. It smells good. I mean, it could be just the box. The box smells good. I love it. I love smells. Ooh. Okay, Baccarat, give me an experience. I'm pulling it. Okay, the wrong way. Here we go. We're pulling it out from the bottom. Is this how the Baccarat come? Is this a real bottle of Baccarat? Did this look real? Let's take it out of the box. Wow, this is nice. Is this a real bottle of Baccarat? I mean, I don't know what what else to say. Like it got the it got the KK on the back. It got the KK on the top. But, how does it smell? Let's go ahead and see how it smell. You know, it's really kind of a, it's really kind of a light smell. It's not too strong. I mean, it don't smell bad. I'm not gonna say it's like, it smells super good, but it don't smell bad. I mean, I'm not sure what the real one smells like. I do have a friend who has the real one and I do wanna ask her if this is hitting for the same. So this is a unisex flavor, uh, flavor. This is a unisex smell. So um, guys and girls can buy this smell. I mean, it definitely is kind of neutral. Like it's not giving like masculine or feminine. It's just giving a nice uh, smell, you feel me? Like, oh, you smell good. But I feel like I definitely would have to spray a lot. I feel like I would have to spray a lot more because it's just so subtle. I'm not sure if it's supposed to be as subtle. Like I keep smelling it, but you know what? I'm just trying to figure out if it is what it is. If I need to spray another one. Do I need to spray another one? Let me just go ahead and spray another one. And this has a nice spray to it too. Very misty. Very actually, y'all. I'm gonna get this Bacchanal of five stars. Yeah. 
10 out of 10, would recommend. I feel like this smells good. I feel like it smells good and it wasn't that expensive. Presentation was great. The box, box opening, everything was great. I could put this back in the box and store it and whatnot. Hefty glass bottle. Let me just show y'all how to spray. I really wanna show y'all how to spray. It's so smooth. It smells good. I feel like it smells good, but it's not too strong of a smell. This is a very popular fragrance. Um, like I said, it did say it was a unisex fragrance. It's definitely not giving like a feminine or a masculine smell. It's just giving more so just a nice smell, a nice neutral smell. Um, it does say it's a natural spray, or as they talk about the bottle. Is the bottle a natural spray? Because that spray is A1. That's the A1 spray. I like that. I like that mist right there. I believe it was only like $35. Shit. Bacarate. I want to say everything in this haul came in about two to... I want to say three weeks. I want to say about two to three weeks. More so about two to three weeks. Everything in this haul besides the Cartier earrings. The Cartier earrings came... Ugh. It's probably, it's still coming <laughs> as we speak. Let me say something. The Cartier earrings was in New York last time I checked yesterday, but nothing's been updated. So um, they did make it into the video. Let's say five to six weeks. Um, go ahead and check the link in the description box. Um, all the um, jewelry and the fragrance will be linked down below. Uh, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe on this video. Hit that like button because it helps my video get to a broader audience. Um, these DH Gate hauls, I will have more coming soon, and I will have more giveaways from DH Gate. So make sure you guys subscribe and stay tuned. This necklace, it was almost going on a DH Gate giveaway. You never know, I might not go, I might not rock with something, and y'all might end up getting it. So make sure y'all subscribe to my channel and stay tuned. It's your boy AB, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.